call 888-NEED-HIM or visit needhim.org. Thank you for your support of 91.7 Moody Radio Nashville, a trusted friend you can count on to help you take the next step in your relationship with Christ. Listen to us anytime online at moodyradiomidsouth.fm or download the Moody Radio app. This is WFCM Murfreesboro, Nashville. 91.7 Moody Radio, Nashville. From the word to life. Got a 19 original, 1967. Mustang AM radio. But we polished it up, cleaned it up, and we've done a full conversion on it. First thing we're going to do is set a few presets. Real estate investments with the money that. Discovery the big boys get in reckless in stores this Friday. Yeah, we're going to find out something. USO. After another. All your presets, all your buttons still work like they always did. You now have AM, FM, stereo, auxiliary in. It has uh, four channels out, 45 watts a channel. Has five pre outs on it if you want to add a sub or an amp to your speakers. It has a USB port, which this is the harness you'll get here, and a thumb drive with music on it. This will charge your devices, and this is your auxiliary in, all built in one. You can mount it with this mount or take it out, mount it in the dash. It also has Bluetooth. And voice command. This is your mic, plenty of a cord. I have mine up on my sun visor. And we're going to run it in and see how it, how it works. Right now you're on FM stereo. You won't go to AM, you just turn it off and ride it back on. It takes you to AM radio. It's online at quickenloans.com. A Quicken Loans. Go back to FM, just turn it off and right back on. Take you to FM. You have an operating LED here and a stereo LED. And right here is a little blue LED for your Bluetooth. Uh, first thing we're going to do is uh, we're going to show you how to pair up the phone. We'll bring our phone up on uh, Bluetooth and get ready to pair it up. We're going to take the volume knob and turn it up twice. So you can hear the volume go up and down twice. That will activate the Bluetooth and uh, we'll start pairing the phone up to it. There's the beep. Little blue light's beeping. It's going to show up on our phone. That come up on our phone. We're just going to tap on it and pair it up. It will beep to let us know it's paired up and the blue light will stay solid blue. Uh, now we're paired up to the phone. We're going to do a voice command on it. We're going to do the same thing we use pairing it up. We're going to turn it up twice. Play music. Let's go to our music and check our volume. There we go. If you want to change your songs on your phone, just take the tuning knob and turn it. It works your phone for you. Well, I guess it was back in 63 when eating my cooking got the better of me, so I asked this little girl. If you want to repeat, you just back up. Or you can go forward by turning that. You can also use your push buttons to do it if you like. A uh, phone call comes in. Uh, the music will die. You just take your tuning knob and turn it up one click and answer the call. When you're done with the call, just turn it down one click. It will go back to doing what it was doing. If it was on Bluetooth, it will go to it. If it's on USB, it will go to it. You can bring your phone up to you. Anything your phone will do. 
It will do through the radio. In the wee small Did you do? Stop music. All right, we're going to put it in pause and go back to radio. Now you're back on FM where we had left it. Your USB port, you're going to get a stick with some music on it because I go ahead and put the file on it, some MP3 music for you. And then you can add to it. Let's do the auxiliary end first. Uh, the Aurora design is sitting there, it's listening for something to come in so it can switch the auxiliary in. You'll get a mail to mail cord. And all you do is plug it in and plug it to your device, your phone, or anything that's got music on it. And as soon as you turn it on, it's going to go straight to it. device all you got to do is turn it off and the, the radio will cycle back around to where you had it in 20 seconds if you don't want to wait that long all you have to do is turn it back off and back on when it comes to high quality it knows apparel, where you're you at, your family at now you're going to hear a beep Nobody covers all the bases. that blue light's going to come back on that's telling you it's found your phone again activewear for men women boys and girls gildan is the brand families trust for all their favorites from head there it See is. The Gildan All Star lineup and find your next favorite. So your Bluetooth is always connected if you got your phone on with you and your Bluetooth on when you get in your car. Get in your family from That's how your auxiliary in works. Uh, we're gonna go and do uh, USB. All you do is plug it in. It goes straight to it. Same method, change the songs, always with your tuner, you can go up or you can back up and repeat. Now if you want to put your, you don't have to pull this in and out so much. Unless you want to charge your phone. If you want to put this in pause and go back to radio, you just take the volume knob and just like pairing it up, but you're going to go counterclockwise. And that will put this in pause and go back to radio. One, two. That's gone to pause. Now we're going to cycle back around the radio. This little LED is going to blink a couple of times and we're going to go back to radio. Now we're back on radio. Bluetooth is active all the time as long as that blue light is lit up. Now you want to bring your stick up, going down the road, and you're listening to FM or AM, you want to listen to your favorite music, same method, turn it down twice. Right back to where you left it. Treble and bass. Let's go back to radio. We'll put that back in pause. We'll find a little music and I'll show you how to do the uh, fader and balance. So he would you know, settle, I suppose. That sounds like that. Now to do your fader and balance, you have treble and bass. There's your bass, there's treble. There's a notch right there for the center of that. You will go clockwise twice. That's a 12 to 2 motion. One, two. It's going to beep and that's going to put you in the fader mode. Now 
now you're in the fader mode. As long as you're moving this, it will stay there. There's your front speakers, there's your rear speakers. You find what you want, you just stop, and it's gonna beep. Back on treble and bass. Find that notch again. This time we're gonna go counterclockwise twice. That will put you in the balance mode. Going to balance, right and left. There's your right ones. There's your left ones. As long as you're moving this, it will stay in that mode. You find what you want, just stop. It will beep once. Back on treble and bass. We repainted the uh, chrome stripe in here and repolished all this and redone the background in it. And uh, it's ready to go. It's uh, repolished all the push buttons. I like the chrome push buttons on these. And repolished the knobs. I got a couple of places I got to work on before you get it. But it's ready to ship. Uh, all the wiring comes with it. The stick drive. You just let me know what kind of music you like. And it's ready to go. Original 1967 Ford Mustang Radio. Thank you.